Hey everybody, welcome to another awesome reading we got here. Pickapile.com makes it houses.net. This is one of the famous ones, so we're going to do four piles on this one. It's called, Who is Jealous of You and Why? What are they saying? All that kind of funky stuff. We're going to find out who these... <laughs> we're going to find out who these suckers are, right? Pile one, we got the star. Pile two, we have the cookie glue. Pile three, we have the life and death, light and dark buckle. And pile four, we have... The pocket Swiss Army knife. All right, so pick a pile. I'll see you guys on the other side, all right? I love you. Take care. Hey, pile one. Those of you who chose the star. This is going to be your reading where we find out who is jealous of you, why are they jealous of you, what are they saying, and what's going to happen between you guys, all right? So let's see. Here are your cards. Seven of Pentacles. Could be an earth sign. The world. Five of swords. Nine of wands. And the king of wands. Okay, I'm saying this could be an earth sign. You could be a fire sign. Okay, what I'm seeing here is this person is someone you've known for like seven years, roughly around that time, five to nine years, but I'm seeing strongly seven, all right? Uh, there could be an age difference between you two. This person has been watching you for a very long time, and they always have this attitude with you. Like, every time you can tell they're trying to get information about you, you kind of see displeasure in their face, but like, it's like they go along with it. Whatever it is you're saying or doing, they go along with it. I'm seeing you caught this person lie to you a couple times. You always get this vibe that this person uh, hides how they really feel. This is the energy I'm getting. Whenever you contact them or they contact you, it seems like there's like an uneven energy distribution. Whenever you meet this person, whenever you see them, it always feels like they're in the same place. Um, getting that strongly. I'm seeing you're someone very powerful though. You're someone that people listen to you. You're always going into the future headstrong. And this person's jealous of that. This person's jealous that people in your life respect you, right? And this person wants that. They crave that. Like this person craves attention. I'm seeing this is someone who uh, maybe is like a wannabe on social media. Like they uh, maybe post a lot or like they post their food every time. Like they post their food for no reason. Like, no one's asking them, yo, post your food. This guy's posting their food every day. Like, I'm seeing people around this person, like, feel like they're a burden. And, like, it's like this person is completely oblivious to how much baggage they bring around them. Like, this person, a lot of people know this person as a liar, not just you. You Like, people call this person out on that a lot. I'm seeing this, this used to be your friend. This, this person used to be your friend. Uh, maybe you met online. I'm seeing that strongly. You met this person online. Or at work. It's either online or at work, right? Or school or something like that. But basically, the longer this relationship went with you and this person, whoever it is, uh, their true colors came out. You slowly saw, okay, this person lies a lot. This person has other people that are also tired of them. Like, you saw that. You know that. For some reason, this person, when they talk to you, <laughs> And you look at them, right? It's like they feel that you know about it. You don't, right? But they feel like you know that they're jealous. Or they feel like you know everything about them when they look at you. So I'm seeing this person doesn't make eye contact a lot. They're like really shifty. They uh, talk very fast. They talk very fast but act very slow. So you know that this person is just in their head. Um... They're also burdened by their own thoughts. I'm seeing this is someone who frequently makes promises, then messes it up, and then apologizes, but their apology is, like, hollow. Uh, and then you feel sorry for this person. I'm seeing the highlight of your friendship is pity. And at times, this person tries to make you pity them, and then you get angry about that. I'm seeing you see right through that, but you genuinely try to help this person. You also, sometimes you thought, okay, what's in it for me, but... You never let that dictate your heart space for the person, right? You were just a decisive person. I think that 
how attractive you are it attracted you to this person like this person is also i'm seeing maybe attractive but their manipulative tactics make them unattractive to you in particular and this person is jealous because i think i'm feeling strongly that this person feels they work harder than you and you have more fruit than them that's the direct message i'm getting like i'm seeing both of you worked like the same amount of time on something and like this person lies and cheats to get what they want or they try to use emotions to get people to give them what they want whereas you you have a similar backstory to this person but you just your work is more sincere so you get fruit out of it and this person is working they feel like and that's their opinion they feel like they work harder than you but they don't see anything showing for it but what i'm seeing is you both have stuff but this person is just a less grateful person than you. So they're jealous of you. Okay, let's get into why, right? This is who this person is. It could be, remember, Earth. It could be any sign. But I'm seeing Earth or someone who cares about money a lot. But this person is jealous of you. Because you're very passionate about your life. I'm seeing you're very... Uh, joyous. You're very, like, happy to see the future. They're not. They're in denial. They're just, like, too busy chasing today. Okay, I'm seeing this person is someone... Okay, you may have had a past relationship with this person, like a romantic one. Uh, it doesn't have to be, but... I'm seeing you walked away from this person, and they hate that. They can't let you go. You told this person that their efforts are useless, because I'm seeing you pointed out this person's flaws, right? And they weren't listening. As a matter of fact, they hung up on you. They hung up... Once the conversation took a serious turn, that's what I'm seeing. And they couldn't forget you ever since. What else do I need to know about this person? Well, they're seeing you powerful right now, but they're telling other people that you're dishonest. Everything that you call them out on, they're saying that you are that. They're saying you're stuck on them. But the truth is, they know deep inside that you don't need anybody. And they have proof of that. You could be born in April. Or September. Or May. I'm seeing that this person's lying about you right now. They're lying about you. They're saying you're not as successful as you are or that you're unreliable. This person could be a cancer or have that in their chart. I think this person is lying about you. What are they saying? Oh, they're saying you don't got it like that. They're telling other people that, but they're watching you. They're thinking about how to lie to you. Something like that. They're, they're saying lies about you. Um, okay, what kind of lies? Clarify justice. Reverse. King of Wands of Bright. Okay, so this King of Wands came out twice. Okay, this person is telling other people that you're not faithful or that you're a player. But they're really just bored. They're waiting for you. They feel like you spent a lot of time trying to help this person and now you're not. Like, now you're not. Like, you got bored of them, like, in some way. Like, you realize this person's not changing. So, they're waiting on you. They're feeling very bored in their life. So, they're talking trash about you. And they're telling people how they left you, but it's clear from the cards that you left them. You left them because they weren't giving you commitment. That's the story. And now they're saying they wasted their time, but they were the one always being emotionally partial with you. <laughs> What a fucking loser. You're getting richer on your side of the planet. You feel richer. You're getting richer. You're making more bountiful uses of your time at this current point in time. What's this person saying about you? Six of Cups reverse that you are bad. You are bad news. You only brought bad things to their life. They're lying about you. But they see you moving on with their life. That's why they're mad. They're mad because they didn't listen to you. Because you were right. What were you right about? Yeah, yeah. This person's a very dishonest person. Since you told them the truth, they're going around lying about you. Could be an air sign. They see you happy. That makes them more angry. Okay, let's see. Who are they telling? I'm seeing they're telling people at their workplace. 
or they're telling this new person that they're dating and that person doesn't like to hear it it's like this person is trying to use you use you and your image to feel less poor about their own life they're talking about you to ignite passion in their own life because their life was dull before you but I'm seeing that even talking crap about you makes them happy in some way it makes them feel like they're going somewhere in life just just talking about you makes them feel like they're going somewhere this person can't get over you they miss you every day this person is feeling like you you also don't want it to be over like something tells this person that it's not over they want to come back to reconcile with you, but I'm seeing that uh, you may not be looking in their direction. Clarify the devil reverse. The hermit upright. Yeah, you're alone. You're standing alone because you don't want anyone to confuse you. You've surpassed their games. I'm seeing this is someone that used to play a lot of emotional and mental games with you. Excuse me. And then you stop giving them attention. You were, you were possibly obsessed with this person in some way because you really cared about them, but then things took a turn. Uh, yeah, but you're nurturing yourself and those around you can see it. Maybe you're getting married soon, uh, Queen of Pentacles. This is like a marriage card, one of the marriage cards. Oh, reverse. You maybe... Um, this person may be wishing bad on you right now. They may be stuck in some way. So they're like wishing bad on your success. Maybe they hope that you don't move on uh, from them. Yeah, they hope you stay stuck on them. Four of Pentacles. They want you to be scared of losing them. 11-11 was on the clock when I pulled that card. Alright, so Eight of Pentacles reverse. They're like wishing that you don't have money. Or like they're telling people that you don't have money. Or that you don't have a job or something. They're telling people that. Why are they telling people that? The moon! Because they have emotions for you. They don't understand their full emotions for you. Why not? Clarify the moon. The world upright. They, they don't see why you're successful and they're not. They feel your success. Maybe they don't see it, right? So that's why they're talking shit. But they feel you're more successful than them. No matter what they do. No matter what they say. No matter where they go. Who they tell. Even the people that they tell... Know that you have it better than they do. Does this person even realize that? They do not. They're in denial. They're even dragging their feet more to apologize to you. Their own spirit is telling them that you have it going on. Like, they're not confused about you. They know who you are. They know your reality. But they're busy selling lies about you. What's wrong with this person, dude? What's wrong with them? Let's ask that. That's a good question. Judgment. They're waiting for things to get better or worse. This person is just like really bored with their life, I'm seeing. Like they just want something to happen so bad. Maybe they want they want to reconcile with you. They miss you. But I'm asking a, a bold question here. Who would want someone like this? Oh, you do apparently. You wanna still marry them. <laughs> You wanna? I think this is my pile, yo. <laughs> oh, sheesh. <laughs> oh, man. Alright, let's ask another question. Let's see. Who's jealous of my pile one? Who else is jealous of my pile one? Who else is jealous of my pile one? I'm seeing it's mainly this person here. Or another air sign. Gemini, Libras, Aquarius. I'm seeing it could be people from your workplace. No, it's, it's mainly this person. This person that you let go of. They're the main person jealous of you. They don't want it to be over. They may be coming soon. The outcome is they may be coming soon. To uh, come back with more lies about commitment. This may be their next move. So if they come at you with something, don't take it serious right away. They're still high. They mean it. Like they want the Ten of Pentacles with you, right? 
but they're hiding the fact that uh, they're not going to give you all the chips. They're still going to be holding back some details. So, you know what to do now. So, do it how you want to do it, all right? Pile one, this has been your reading about who's been jealous of you. I hope this helped out. I love you, all right, guys? The star pile. I'll see you on the next one. Bye. Hey, pile two. Those of you who chose this cookie glue. You guys are the second pile. This reading is who is jealous of you? Why are they jealous? What are they saying? And what's the likely outcome between you guys? All right, so let's get started. The fool could be Aries or you could be page of cups water sign the hangman oh my god I'm seeing a lot of people man are jealous of you pal too the hangman but could be Pisces wheel of fortune reverse and the ten of pentacles wow okay I'm seeing three three people Three people here are jealous of you. Straight up. Okay. There could be Aries, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Pisces. I'm seeing heavy Pisces here. Okay. Could also be Aquarius or Taurus. Okay, I'm seeing... I'm seeing it's three distinct people and three distinct stories as well, man. Okay, so, well, what I'm seeing here mainly, people are jealous of you because you're resilient. In some ways, I'm seeing these three people, two people may be younger than you that are jealous. One person could be older than you and jealous. Maybe this person who's older than you and jealous, they're mad because... They may be waiting on you to make a decision for something. Maybe uh, you put this person through a lot and now they're like, oh, wow. They're stuck now. They don't know what's going to happen next and they're jealous. 12. You could know this person for 12 years. You could know this person for 12 years. I'm seeing something like that. 12 or more years. The other person I'm seeing, I'm seeing these other two people. You may message them a lot or something about that. Like, something about uh, the future makes them jealous of you. Maybe they see that you're very kind at heart, and they don't understand that, so they get jealous. They get jealous that how you could be so forgiving, or how you could be so sweet. Like, how nice you are makes people hate you, or like something like that. I'm seeing this person got jealous that you're a caring person, or maybe you're very uh, easygoing. Like, you don't really hold things against people. Maybe this person once saw you in a bad position and then they saw you rise so now they're jealous of you or they're jealous that you have more money than them. Like they're jealous that you seem to have the mentality for family, right? And these people, these haters, right? They, they don't understand that. I'm seeing like it could be three people that just hate how much you know what you want. I'm seeing you may not be going through the best time now and people are still jealous of you. Like, they're jealous. They're talking about you. Um, I'm seeing these people don't put as much effort into their life as much effort as they put into hating you or being jealous of you or talking trash about you. Maybe someone uses you to talk to other uh, people of the opposite sex. Like, they use you as a point to make in their conversation when they flirt with other people. I'm seeing these people are in their head about you, so they're jealous of you, okay? I don't really see many other details, just that they um, they feel that you're going to make it one day. And they do whatever they can to hold you back. I'm seeing they're jealous of how much progress you've made in life. I'm seeing they're jealous of your carefree nature. I'm seeing they're jealous because they check your pics and they see you're happy for some reason, for some of you. You could be an Aries or Pisces. Not just them, right? Could also be your sign okay cookie glue my cookie glue pile okay clarify the fool who is this person that hates you two cards person number one that's jealous of you 
Okay, I'm seeing this could be an Aries that uh, is very much... This could be an ex-boyfriend, ex-girlfriend. Um, they're jealous that they don't know what you're doing right now. They feel like maybe you cut them off in some way. So they're kind of jealous about who you may be with or something like that. But I'm seeing they want a connection with you. That's the first person that's jealous. You could see them as a very logical person or someone who's letting you go. But they're still jealous because they, they're they jealous of who you might be with. Like, they want to have you. They're not jealous in a negative way. This is someone who's lusting for you in some way. Or they're very, um, you guys had a relationship for like 8 years or something. Or they may have known you for 8 years or 10, 8 to 10 years. But they're wondering about your sex life. This was this one's doing. What about this one? Okay, page of cups here. This over here is a water sign X of yours. Or it could be a Virgo. This is your ex from six years ago or something. They miss you. Six to seven to nine years. This one misses you. They want to send you a message. But they're not. They're, they're hoping that you're going to message them. This one's not going to do it. Because they're kind of taking a break from you. They could have water in their chart, right? They don't exactly have to be water. Um, maybe you just find this person immature. But this person is just very far away from you. They're, they're undergoing something where... They're learning a higher way to love um, and stuff like that. What about this Pisces person? The fool reverse, the sun reverse. Okay, this older person here. Uh, this person doesn't want to see you happy. Or maybe they they're unhappy without you. They don't want you to have a future without them. They believe they are your future. They feel betrayed by you. Their emotions are high for you one day and they're low for you the other day. Okay, so I'm getting for this pile. These are jealous lovers. Pile two, these are jealous lovers of you. All three of them are lovers. The first one seemed to be a co-worker. This one is lovers, lovers pile. So two of these people love you. This other person is very bitter that you could be moving on without them. This person is not a good energy. These other two, I don't know. They're still jealous over you in some way. But one is jealous of you, so they're taking a break. And one is jealous of you, but constantly thinking about how to make love to you. Like, one is just thinking that. Like, they're thinking about maybe the past times you guys have had an encounter. Or they're just thinking about how much they love you. They're ready to, to try again with you. This person is ready to try again with you. And I'm seeing, like, you have been through a lot with this first person, this Aries or Leo. And uh, they want to try again. This person here, this immature one, is just seeing what you do first. And they're banking on the fact that you've been together for a long time. This person is taking a break from you because they're actually looking at life in a new way. And there's a siren blaring there. So that could be, there's an urgent message right now that you're receiving. Okay, so. This third person is not doing great without you. Like... They're stuck in their life. They're waiting on what you do next to change what they do next. But they're pretty upset. They could also be a Leo. Um, Tower, Scorpio, Aries. This person doesn't want to let you go. They want to reconcile with you. But they're not sure what's going to happen here. Uh, I'm seeing this person is thinking about every night in a very toxic way. They may be losing sleep. They may be breadcrumbing you just to see if you react different. That's what I'm seeing, I believe. I'm seeing this person, this third person, I don't see a lying energy come from these two people, but I'm seeing this third person as a liar, like, clearly, they're a fucking liar, like, a bad one, like, this one is just straight up lying to you just to get the advantage over you. These other two people, I'm seeing that they're more just curious, oh, what's gonna happen, but this one is straight, straight up trying to manipulate your next move, this older person, I'm seeing straight, it's an older person, they could have water in their chart. Okay, so people <laughs> people are jealous of you because they want to know who you're going to choose. That's what they're... they're okay. <laughs> I'm seeing you have like nine different people flirting with you. But like this one is like... These three are your like main options, right? But there's like nine different people trying to get with you. Nine ones. And you're like blocking all nine of these people. Nine, ten of these people. You're blocking all nine, ten of these people. 
uh, and people are not jealous at you. <laughs> They're jealous over you. That's this pile. <laughs> They're jealous over you. They want to be with you. They like, oh, you're so hot. You're so happy. You're so uh, majestic. You have such a rich energy. They want to taste your energy. Ooh. But like sometimes they get an idea you're a player. Or like they want to play you but like you're know, like very fiery hot but like you're so like you're going through a lot of changes right now my pile too and you're still confused about all these options you really do want to settle down but you just don't want your heart broken again and you're enjoying your single life right now so okay so okay what's the outcome for all these jealous pies ace of wands you're gonna choose somebody uh you're gonna choose somebody and it may be someone new. I'm saying it's someone new. I mean, it's not that as these people. It could be one of these people you never chose before. Right? Uh, it could be... It's not a water sign. And two of these are water. So it may not be these two. It could be... be uh, yeah. Whatever you choose is going to leave somebody stuck. Is what I'm seeing here. What's the outcome for my pile too? Five of Pentacles Reverse. Okay, if you've been going through a, a bad time in any single way, like emotional, health-wise, or financially, I'm seeing that won't be for long. You're going to take yourself out of that. Uh, you won't have to rely on a relationship to do that. I'm seeing you do that by yourself, and you're going to do it in a very happy way. Um, you're going to end this cycle of pain that's always been plaguing you, Ten of Swords. And you're going to cut out liars in your life. Anyone who you feel like is a liar, you're going to cut them out. Maybe you used to have some negative energy, but I'm seeing you're not going to be like that anymore. You're going to do what you can do to become more stable. And people are going to be jealous at you and jealous over you for those reasons. That's how it's going to be. Okay, pile two. This was your reading. I hope you liked it. I'll see you on the next one. Bye. Hi, pile three. Those of you who chose the light and dark life and death belt buckle. This is going to be your reading for, let's put it here, this thing is pretty dense, huh? Ah, let's see, alright, here we go. This is going to be your pile for who is jealous of you, what are they saying, what's the outcome, what can you do about it, alright? So, Queen of Pentacles could be Earth sign, could be a family member. Three of Wands. Page of Pentacles, Six of Pentacles, and Seven of Wands. Alright. Let's see. Okay, I'm seeing for the last three to seven years, somebody from your past, a family member, or someone you once dated, right? Could be the mother of your kids. Hell, could even be your own mom. Someone here is upset about you, jealous about you. They may be talking trash about you. Maybe talking trash about how long something is taking. Could be something like that. Um, maybe you're a student. You're someone very uh, virtuous, happy about life. You're someone very uh, driven. To live your best life. You are recently working. You've been making more money than you could have. You recently came into a spot where you're able to help people you weren't able to help before. I'm saying you're a very kind person. Pile 3. You seem to be running away from these family members. It's like these family members you're ignoring, right? These are the people who are jealous of you. They, they ask you for money. I'm getting they ask you for money. They know somehow you have money, so they're asking you for money. Or they're talking about your finances or something. You may have helped these people, and they're talking trash about you in some way. I'm saying maybe you you recently had a talk with them, right? Maybe the last seven days ago, or seven weeks. I'm saying seven days ago. Last week. Okay. <laughs> I'm getting this specific story, please. If it's not your story, it's not your story. But I'm getting seven days ago, you got these messages, and maybe you ignored it, right? And right after you ignored the message, this person was talking trash about you right away. Like, they had this feeling that you ignored them, and they were talking trash about you. I'm seeing it's in the family. Maybe, yeah. 
somewhat, or maybe it could be someone who used to help you with money. Now they're talking trash about you or something. This could be someone you met uh, at work. I'm really getting, no, I'm really getting it's someone from a foreign country. I'm seeing it. you may have traveled and you became abundant and this person is back where you're from and they're hating on you. They're jealous of you for something. I don't know what it is. When it comes to you, I'm seeing you're someone who's worked hard for what you have. You're just protecting yourself. That's what you're thinking. I'm seeing you're very kind. And you know what? You have every right to protect yourself because these people who you've helped, they're the ones cursing at you, talking shit about you. You help them with money, but they tell people you don't have money or something. Fucking hate. Whoever, <laughs> yo, I'm sorry if this is your family. I fucking hate your family, dude. They are jealous. They're jealous that you're so happy. They, they know, like, you approach life with a very young energy, youthful. Like, you never age. I'm hearing that. Specifically, you never age. Because, like, you're so happy on the inside, right? That you don't age. Like, people see on your face. You look the same. Like, you look as healthy as you did five years ago. People are like, what the hell? Like, this guy never ages. Like, this guy's young as fuck. Like, <laughs> <laughs> like I'm getting that I'm getting that specifically like no matter what this person whoever's talking crap crap about you right they always feel like they have less than you and it's like when you communicate with them you just <laughs> it's like you feel their neediness through the message right okay what does pile 3 need to know who's jealous of my pile 3 or some message they need to know. The tower. You could have had a bad argument with this person last. They could be a Scorpio or Aries. Let me see. The Starverse could also be Aquarius. Okay. So this part or Aquarius or Taurus, right? Maybe someone's like trying to like butt in and ask you about your relationship. Or like something about your marriage. Maybe your marriage... You moved on from an unstable marriage. I'm seeing your wife, your partner, right? May have had secrets. They held on to secrets, right? And I'm seeing you called it off. And the people back home are talking crap about it. Someone is making fun of your relationship. Man, fuck. This must be my pile too, man. <laughs> um, I'm seeing it didn't work out with an Aquarius or a Taurus. And... Or water sign. And I'm seeing that... It's because you made a best call, right? You made a best call that you don't want this anymore or this marriage. And you, like, you got very uh, intuitive about it, right? Like you had a bad feeling about this, right? And you moved on. Like maybe both of you moved on, but I'm seeing heavily that you moved on. Like you took your emotional baggage and you went, right? But check it. These people, when they got the news of that, they started talking crap. Like that's what made them start to talk more crap. Like, oh... They, they're saying to other people, oh, you're not doing as good as you say. Or, like, you're going through a dark time. But these people aren't helping you. Like, they're talking shit about you. Some people here know you're going through a hard time. And they're talking more shit about you. That's what they're doing. And, I don't know, man. Heavily, I'm saying it's your family, man. Fuck. Could be Cancer Pisces. Or a fire sign. I'm thinking though you're making moves in your life. That's why they're talking shit about you also. Like, whatever you're doing is still more than them. So they're getting mad at you. Yeah, they're getting mad. They're getting mad that everything about you has changed. You're healthier. You, you seem more educated. Like, people see that whatever you did, it grew. And they're getting jealous. They, they're getting jealous. Okay, I got this. They're getting jealous that you were right about everything you said. You got, you said, yo, I'm going to do this. You did this. You said, I'm going to do that. You did that. They're jealous. They're jealous of you, man. Because, okay, I'm seeing these people always, when they want to do something in life, they always get stuck. Like, they want to ask 9 million people before they do something. Like, they always need someone's permission. Or they always need to talk to people before they do something. That's why they never do anything. Like, they talk. They don't do shit. They just talk shit. 
Yeah, I'm seeing you just stop arguing with this person. Like, this is someone who you known for nine years, or you have a nine year age gap, or is someone who it could be a Leo. I'm seeing this person just straight up miserable. They're miserable. They they know that, and you know what? <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Pile three. Look, check this out. Right, the last time you talked to this person, right? Uh, the way you talked to them. You saw that they're holding details back, right? So this person that's jealous of you, you realize that they're miserable about something. So you just stop talking to them, right? And now this person is uh, thinking about the past about you. They're heartbroken that you left. <laughs> they're heartbroken that you left because why? Because they had something stable with you. I'm seeing this person that loved you or they felt your love at one point, but now they don't. It's like now they don't. Uh, could be a Gemini or a Virgo or Aries. And then, yeah, you just went ghost. They also went ghost. Like, I think you exposed it. Could be a Virgo. I think you exposed that this person is just not... They're not as friendly as they said they were. Like, you, you found out something about them. And you took yourself out of that situation. And they're jealous. They're jealous that, oh, you left me? Like that. This person is jealous. Okay, let's see. I'm seeing like everyone's jealous of you, man. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six different people are jealous of you. Six. Oh, six. The lovers reverse. I'm seeing six different lovers are jealous of you. Six different people you made love with. Um, it didn't work out, right? But six different girlfriends you had or boyfriends you had, they're all jealous of you. I'm seeing Virgo Gemini here again. Virgo Gemini Aries, number one. Let's see. Four Swords. I'm seeing you gave it a break. You gave it a break because, like, you took a nap. I'm seeing, like, you took a nap and someone got an attitude with you. Like, you just took a fucking nap and they're, like, thinking you're cheating. Like, all right. <laughs> I'm seeing an argument like that, man. But but you're going to keep shining. Pile three, my pile three. All your wishes came true and are coming true. I'm seeing sometimes you kind of stressed out about that, but I'm seeing your wishes are coming true. They're coming true. like, And it's because you keep showing life this can-do attitude. Like, You have big dreams, and the only advice here I'm seeing for you is maybe you should just tell less people about it when you do it also. I'm seeing you don't talk as much as the other people do, but sometimes you get stressed about your dreams and you talk about it, but sometimes even when you talk about your dreams... It, it fucks with people's demons, right? So they send negative energy to your dream. So try to keep it less. Even the people you tell, tell less. Talk about yourself less. Because I'm seeing people give you evil eyes. So many people are jealous of you. You should be careful, right? Okay, what's the outcome? These people may come to you, try to reconcile. What's the outcome here for my pile three? Concerning these jealous fucks. What's the outcome? Not right. Four of Pentacles. I'm seeing you're going to be in a very safe space. Uh, you may sometimes have fear. I'm seeing maybe sometimes you feel worried about being judged by these people. Uh, the outcome is that those people will always be in a more confused place than you. They're jealous of your work, but you'll have work. They may ask you for money instead when you become rich. I'm seeing you, you may become rich in the future. And I'm seeing that... You may change, you know. You're a very kind and sharing person, but I see on the way to you becoming wealthy, you may become uh, very distant from needy people anymore. You're just going to, like, protect your money. And uh, a lot of people are going to come towards you with lies to try to get your money. And I'm seeing uh, you're going to pity these people, and you're just going to move on with your life. That's what I'm seeing. You're going to you're gonna pity those people from your past, and you're just going to move on. You're going to live a happy life, and... It's not going to come easy, but you're just going to always decide what is best to protect your wealth. And I'm seeing you're going to be successful at that. I'm seeing it's family who's jealous of you most. Be careful there, Pile 3. All right, I'll see you guys on next one. I love you all, all right? Bye. Hey, Pile 4. Those of you chose this pocket knife, all right? So this is going to be your pile for... Who's jealous of you? Why? What's their outcome, right? Ten of Swords, reverse. The Tower, reverse. 
Eight of Cups reverse. The Sun reverse. The Emperor reverse. Okay, right off the bat, I'm seeing it could be a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Aries, Scorpio, Leo. This kind of energy. Or any water sign. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Okay, so... Okay, pile four. I'm seeing this is someone you've known for a long time. Uh, eight to ten years. Eight to fifteen. Uh, eight to sixteen years, actually. I'm seeing this is a heavily uh, emotional connection. Uh, very logical and emotional connection. Just never ended. I'm seeing this person may have told you harsh words in the end. It's not over, though. Something is not over. Maybe this person is jealous of you because they're in denial about something. I think that this person is in denial about how logical you are. This person is jealous that you're smarter than them. I'm going to put that out right away. Okay? This person thinks you're smarter than them. This person thinks you have more heart than them. You have more happiness than them. You have more stability than them. Your decisions hold more weight than them. Okay, this person is straight up jealous of everything you have. Is it a particular person or is it 8 to 10 people or what? We've got to go right into this. Okay, this is an ex-lover. They're jealous of everything you have. Something, an argument happened here where one partner's toxicity came to the light. And this was what the argument was about. It was about marriage. It was about taking it forward. It was, or it could have been about school. It could have been about some spiritual truth. A higher lesson. A higher love. Maybe um, you guys got into an argument about your future, right? Uh, and I'm seeing that you were right. Straight up. And this person got angry. You shook this person's core beliefs. And they got jealous. They got jealous that how does someone make so much sense? Well, the truth is, is this person is just a dishonest person. So they're jealous of you. They're jealous that your honesty and intellect are the same, are one in the same. This person thought is smart to manipulate people. I'm seeing this is someone who lies to a lot of people. Like this person's a, a chronic liar. When they can control a situation, they do it. When they can't control something, they try to do it with lies. And I'm seeing this person failed at it with you. Like I'm seeing this person knows how to confuse people, right? But when it came to you, you were better at them at their own game. And they fell in love with you when that happened. When they were your ex, right? I know, when they were your partner in the past, they always try to trick you. You also can't get this person off your mind. You love them a lot. You, you push them to live their best life possible. And they held resentment for that. This person gave you the image that they're moving on, but they got even more sad without you. Double sun reverse. I'm seeing this person... You... Whatever you argued about, right? Your main point was you wanted this person to reflect on their behavior. You also want to reconcile with them. They want to reconcile with you, but it could have been a third-party situation that broke you guys apart. I'm seeing you showed them everything they're doing wrong, and you did it with the most love you could do it with. And this person didn't respect it because you're too honest for them. This person's immature. They can't handle the truth. And they can't handle that the truth can also be intellectual. This person thinks that... Uh, this person thinks manipulation is intelligent. It is, but there's a limit on it, yeah? Because you beat them at their own game. Now they feel stupid. You showed them that they're, they're the dumb one. You, you proved it. And this person hung up the phone, basically. Because you won. You beat them at their game. And they and then you walked away. You still loved them, but you didn't come back. The Emperor Reverse. I'm seeing this really got you angry. This person could have also been angry at you. This person could be lying to other people about you. That you're not happy, you're not stable, you're not this. They're really projecting how they feel about themselves onto you. My pocket knife pile. You beat this person at their own game and they're jealous. And they're jealous even more because they're falling in love with you. Clarify the Ace of Cups. What does this love represent? What do you mean?
Okay, this person... Okay, you blew this person's ego into tiny little pieces. And now they want to... They want you back. Oh, you hear that? The storm is going crazy out there. Oh, I saw a reading one. Yo, this also feels like my pile. I saw a reading ones that said a storm may signify something. And every time something goes crazy, there's a storm. Two major kinds here. Look, death and the judgment ace of cups. This and and the ace of cups came out like this first, and then it spun like this. So day by day, this person's falling in love with you because you showed them that their ego was the thing holding them back. And once they lost their ego, now all the love is pouring in, right? The truth is pouring in. The sadness is pouring in. The regrets are pouring in that they rejected your offer for marriage. This person may have left you at the altar. And they regret it now. They regret it now. Ten of Cups reverse. I'm seeing this could have been a divorce. They know now. They didn't know then. They know now. Six of Wands. This person seeing you glow up. Maybe your success was very... Like, your success wasn't overnight, right? It was a very slow process. But this person always made you feel criticized for your... Uh, you're a late bloomer, right? And this person always tried to one-up you. Maybe they're always scared of your success. So they try to talk shit about you. But I'm seeing, like, this person doesn't get things started in their life. Like, they have a problem getting things started. And when you get things started, they get jealous of you. Instead of being happy for you, they're your partner... They get jealous of you. It's like this person was competing with you the whole time. Uh, but they want to come back, reconcile with you. They want to give you something solid this time because you're their world. This person may be watching you online. They, they're watching you move on. They used to paint you as this picture as the Emperor Reverse. But now they're seeing you as the Emperor Upright. You may be an Aries. This person may be going through some financial difficulties right now. So maybe they're distant. Or they may come back for that reason. I'm seeing mainly though it's not that. It's just that they're happy that you have a glow up. And they're anxious. Ever since they left, they've been anxious about you. They wonder, what are you up to? What are you doing? And like, there's your success keeps coming back to They They feel like you have options, so they're jealous. Like, maybe they feel like you have more options than them in life and in romance. So like, they're jealous because they had you and they had you, but they lost you because you're honest. So now they're jealous of you. They're jealous of how creative you are. I'm seeing you, you're very like, flamboyant you like you you make art you could be an artist or you could be a ceo of your company or you're the ceo in line of your company you're very hard worker this person tried to say you're lucky about everything but every one of your actions proved that you're not lucky you do this like you you they they see proof that you do this so they're fucking losing their mind right the six of wands is keep coming. Like, you're very popular, or like this person feels that way about you. You're popular, so like they don't get it. Like, they can't wrap their mind around it. Like, I had a chance with this person. Like, this person is asking them, so yo, I had a chance with this person. Now they're seeing you for who you really are, and they feel like they're just one of your options. But whenever they think back to what happened, uh, they see that you're just a happy person. That's why you were able to give them happiness. But I'm saying this person didn't used to trust their feelings when it came to you. They always used to be impartial so that... No, they always used to be partial so that um, they never feel dumb. If you were to reject them, they wouldn't feel dumb about it. But now they feel like they lost their wealth. Their only true wealth in life. They lost it. King of Swords. You told this person some hard truth. And then they cursed at you and, left, and went to give someone else an offer of love. They... They shouted at you and then went to someone their level. And that didn't work out. I'm seeing this person got dumped there. Or they they realized that it was a downgrade. So they weren't happy in that situation either. I'm seeing this person may contact you. Uh, but you feel kind of burdened about them. Your life is kind of getting lucky. They may be a Cancer, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Or Scorpio. They want to reconcile somewhere I feel that so do you. But the way this person left you made you very, very unhappy. You you knew that they lied. They lied about why they're leaving. This person's a wreck, pretty much. And they're jealous of you because you're healthy in every direction. And they're not. So basically, okay, what's the outcome for Pile uh, 4 and their person? This person's going to be confused about what to do. Uh, but 
I'm seeing they become more spiritual and they'll figure it out about how to amass their wealth. So whatever you do, this person's going to find the light somewhere in their life. But, you know, I'm seeing you walking away did a lot for this person. This person became more enlightened after that. They took their own opportunities more serious after that. After they didn't take you serious, but they saw you take yourself serious, that's helping them develop themselves. So I'm seeing a beautiful energy here. Two people did what they thought was best, and they will continue to do that. I'm seeing you got the better end of the stick, but hey, this is a jealousy reading. They're supposed to be jealous. <laughs> Alright, Pa4, I love you guys. I'll see you on the next on the right. This has been Who's Been Jealous of You? Pickapa.com, MasonChalices.net. Peace.